I'm going to show you a trick now that a magician showed me recently um, and I worked it out. So this time we're not going to show you how it works, but we're going to see if we can inspire you to do the same. So I have my two spectators here. Um, would you first like to take a card? So what I'd like you to do is cut off roughly a third of the pack, give or take as many as you like, but roughly a third. And look at that card. Show the camera. I won't look. I won't look. If you take roughly a half of that, remember your card. Show the camera. I won't look. I won't look. You happy with your cards? Yeah. yeah? OK, fantastic, fantastic. So now um, I'm going to try and find these cards. I don't know exactly where they are in the pack. But luckily, today, I brought with me two extra helpers that are hidden inside the pack. So if we uh, fan through now, you'll see there's the first helper there, uh, the first joker there, and the second helper there, the second joker there. Now, these two helpers tell me where your cards are. And I can hear them talking. Yes, they are talking to me. Um, they tell me that your card is 17 cards down in the pack. They tell me your card is 43 cards down. I think that's what they said. Um, so now I'm just going to count these out and see if we can find your cards. So 17 and 43. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43. What was your card? Hard, yes, would you like to turn it over? Yeah. Was that indeed the card? Yeah, exactly. And what was your card? Ace of Spades. Ace of Spades, incredible. And even more ridiculously, perhaps, the Jokers even predicted it from the very start that your cards would be 17th card and 43 cards down. Thank you very much. I'm not going to tell you how this trick's done, but you may find if you watch the video very closely and copy exactly what I did, the trick may work for you as well. And then just with a little bit of work, you might be able to look at the math and figure out the mechanics behind it. Go to mathematicalmagic.com for more maths, magic, and teaching resources.